afternoon, DMS. These are your daily announcements. Our special guest star today is Isaac Peterson. There will be a call-out meeting for intramural cross-country on Wednesday, September 7th at 2.45 in room 614. Last night, the 8th grade volleyball team began their season by, defending, by defeating Zionsville West in three close games. Serving well were Megan Sloan, Anna Arndt, and Hannah Eckstein. Leading the team in spikes were Cheyenne Lance, Megan Sloan, and Alex Kramer. We also had great hustle and passing from Cameron Prokrivchak, Hannah Cease and Sarah Tucker. Great job, Eagles. There will be a call-out meeting for anyone interested in joining Robotics Club on Tuesday, August 30th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. in the Robotics Room, room E118 in the Freshman Center. Please bring your parents. The seventh grade volleyball team got off to a great start last night, winning their match against Zionsville West 2-1. Megan Carr, Katie Norris, and Haley Fry had great serving streaks, and Morgan Matea and Reagan Alquist uh, contributed with excellent passing. The girls fought hard in the first game and then in the final game scored 13 points in a row. Congratulations on a great start to the volleyball season. Sitting members from last year need to stop by the guidance office to talk to Mrs. Enders and Mrs. Tharp as soon as possible. The cross country team opened their year with the solid effort from all members of the team at the Hokum Kara meet last night. The varsity relay runners fought hard against great competition and rel ran well considering the extreme heat. Olivia Johnson and Will Savory ran excellent races and were the team's top finishers, placing fifth overall. The JV race was full of courageous efforts, particularly by Jackson Martin and Tucker Sorrells, who stopped, stuck with the leaders through the most of the grueling two-mile race. Good luck to the 7th and 8th grade football team as they head to Lebanon for a 5.30 game tonight. The girls golf team defeated Plainfield last night. Maggie Stevens and Maddie Hine each shot a 46, followed closely by Carolyn Kelly with a 48, Morgan Cornicini with a 50, Claire Stevens with a 51, and Claire Drew with 54. Great job, girls. There will be an ambassadors meeting during SOAR on Monday, August 29th in room 716. Any 7th or 8th grade girl interested in playing lacrosse is welcome to attend some open field opportunities with the high school team. The dates can be found on the ZMS blog. There will be some middle school only events later this fall to include the fifth and sixth graders, but be sure to stay tuned to the announcements. Come out and see if lacrosse is the sport for you. That's it for today. Thanks, Isaac, for helping us out. Have a great day. Carry on my